hi guys welcome back to our channel okay today I'm going to show you how to export like a um, PDF or DWF or prints in the printer uh, as a bulk export okay so before we do that we need to open a file so I just open then you can go to the layout make sure you click the patch set manager then here for now I'm just showing how to export uh, PDFs only and the same setting you can use for the I mean same way you can make it for DWF or print or anything okay so I'm just going to show uh, how to make the settings so click new then I'm going to name as a one PDF okay because I might uh, title it's in a one okay my I'm in sheet click OK then I'll select the a one okay then I'm selecting the PDF and here you can select if it's DWF you can select here DWF or if you need to print you can select any printer because I don't have any printer here that's why it's you cannot see okay so I'm just selecting the PDF for now then I'm selecting the paper size then I'm just selecting the extent so select make sure it's in center of a port also make sure it's in mm and one is to one scale should be don't make it fit to paper okay should be in one is to one and you can select the uh, relevant ctbs i'm selecting my ctb and you can s click preview see it's perfect okay then you can exit click then just set current okay then save okay it's done then you can click publish I mean type publish or in file tab you can get it okay publish then you can see the file is here the which is open because it whatever you open it's automatically click here okay then I'm going to add some file so I'll just show four files only make sure only layout only you don't want to include model space okay so I added already then what you need to do you can see the page setup only apply to the first one okay so we need to apply to the other sheets also so which way we can do it's easy just select all then select the settings so you can see all the PDFs there. So the next thing, make sure this publish to which one you want. It. If it's printing, you can use plot and name setting, and it's with DWF or DWX. You can select this one and PDF. And we are going to print the as a PDF. So we are just clicking PDF. Okay. And in publish option, so you need to click the, the the location you can say which one see where you want to save okay and you can see one here multi sheet file okay so the thing is if it's pick all the PDF which we are exporting it will come in one file I mean it will be a binded one combined I mean okay so if it's untick it will be as a single one it will be as a separate everything okay so make sure it's untick or whatever you want like uh, if you send if you need to send a combined one then you can click the um, uh, multi sheet file okay so i'm just unticking and the thing is here in data 
so I'm always removing this uh, layer information so the thing is whenever we export the PDF you can see in the uh, properties bar uh, all the layer info information you can click turn off or turn uh, you can control it but normally whenever you send it to client or someone make sure you are not including this one that's a standard okay then I'm just clicking close so everything done also make sure uh, this publish in background it's untick if it's tick all the process will be uh, done in background the thing is if there is any error you will not you will not be noticed until it's finished okay so make sure it's untick so I'm just clicking publish then it's asking for the save the setting the thing is uh, this is only for the list so we if we save it like okay for example you have to export the PDF DWF and printing for example but it's same set of drawing so what you can make just save then you will get the same setting from using here in the sheet list so I'll show you the example if you want. then I'm just going list okay I'm just saving here so okay it's exporting now so I'll show you after that okay it's done so I'll show the folder you can see all the PDF done if you open one you can see it's done okay so it's just very simple so just make sure you are have the setting so the okay now we have a four drawing I mean the list we saved right so okay for example I'm just publishing again and I'm just delete okay so I'm going to import the list so I'm just clicking so you can select the list see now you if you want to make DWF just change the setting change here that's all so hope you are enjoying this video I think you uh, understood the setting everything and if you have any doubts or question just comment below the video and make sure you subscribe and click the bell, bell icon okay thanks for watching see you on next video bye bye